What's up everybody? It is officially President's Day. Me and Beanie are gonna be doing a crumble live. We are on TikTok live as well right now. Um, so this is exciting. Oh, we got some people joining. Oh, so, wow. So uh, we, we might be reacting a little bit. So we're doing a YouTube video and a TikTok video at once. So uh, yeah, so if we react to comments, that just might, uh, yeah. that's a little bit different than normal. But this is a special week, Beanie. This is a really special week. Because President's Day? It's well, President's Day. Yeah. And we're, we're off of work. Thank today. you for, yeah, thank you for the off day. Shout, needed that. Needed that. Shout out to the presidents. Who, who's your favorite president? George Washington. Easy. Damn. Easy answer. That sucks. I was going to pick George Washington. All right, you got George Washington's. Mine's Abraham Lincoln. Okay, yeah, those are like two solid presidents. I, you know, I have some other favorite presidents, but well, let, let's move on to the cookies, guys. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, 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 I'm curious which president would, would like which crumble cookie, you know? And that's how I look at it. Yeah. Um, but dang, yo, man, this is a heavy box. Hey, six, hey, we've had four four packs for the last few weeks. You, you, We knew that a six was coming, Crumble. We just knew it. So we have a six box week here, and this isn't Crumble cookies anymore, y'all. This is just Crumble. And we got Tris Leches down in the corner. Yep. Um, Beanie, any other cookies that stand out to you right now? I'm just going to say Tris Leches. I don't know how Crumble did that. You could have just done a four pack and have that there. You didn't need a six pack with Tris Leches Crumble. You went off this week. I respect it. Sean, if you're from Texas and you and you know what Chewy's is, that's the best Tres Leches I've had. Oh, I agree with you. Yeah. Uh, so one of the things with Tres Leches is it's got to be spongy. If it's like yeah. hard. Yeah, 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 exactly. Yeah. So I'm like really curious to try that. We'll save that for the end. Um, But this is a- uh... What's right here? Oh, whoa! Oh, that could have been bad. That could have been bad. That could have been really bad. Oh, uh, wait, go ahead, Beanie. What's this one? That's a classic peanut butter. Oh, man. All right. Um, That one is iced oatmeal. We both okay. like oatmeal. Okay. This is a chocolate uh, batter. cake batter. Cake batter. batter. Um, this is, of course, chocolate chip. And this last one is lemon cheesecake. Cheesecake. Yep. Yeah. And then tres leches. Tres the cinnamon leches. drizzles on top. Beanie, I feel like I, I, I know what you're going to pick first. Can I just go first real quick? Yeah, yeah, Let's yeah. just get it out of the way. Yeah, we knew that. We knew that. L literally, guys. Like, seriously? Classic. Pizza. Seriously? Just for presentation, that's a 2 out of 10. Come on. Sean. Oh shoot! What was the point of having this cookie? They could have just done four four pack. Classic peanut butter. I agree. Yeah. It, it, this was forced. I'll be honest. This, this, is, so this is pretty forced. Classic peanut butter. I just I, I call it how I see it. So. Mm. So whatever. Um. Ready? You ready? Three, two, one. Five four out of ten. Yep. There yeah, it is. Whatever. I mean, it's just it, it failed. It's 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 a, it's an F. We needed that out of the way. No, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not even gonna dignify it with a respectable, yeah. like you know, follow up. I uh, agree. Let's move on, Sean. You're the next pick. We're not even gonna say anything about the peanut butter cookie, guys. Don't get it this week for sure. Uh, this is why we do the reviews, to be honest with you guys. Exactly. So, Sean, go ahead. you know, right? We gotta be honest in this world. You know, there's too much fake news going around. You gotta be honest. Now the real review starts. Let's do it with ice oatmeal. Fake news media. Oh yeah. You know, they, they, they've been after you lately. Oh yeah, the yeah. fake news media. <laughs> you just can't trust anyone nowadays, guys. All right, Sean, what you, what you got? We're doing ice oatmeal, y'all. All right. This is when the real review starts. We are not classic peanut butter. Did not deserve <laughs> its own review. I'm sorry. Someone out there loves classic peanut butter, probably. So some guy, some guy was like, who works at Cumble was like, man, you know, it'd be really cool if we had a classic peanut butter in the mix. No, no. <laughs> Do people really like peanut butter like that? It's not even that good, <laughs> but bro. If this is like. This is like a, what's that meme where it's like one thing is like, is not like the other or something like that. I, yeah. I don't know. I feel like I. My dog yeah. likes peanut butter and he also eats dirt. <laughs> so, I mean, that should tell you something, right? <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. It's a joke. Sean, it's a joke. People don't understand that. But I'm, right, I'm, I'm hyped about this yeah. one though. Mm -hmm. I'm not gonna lie. I expected it to be harder, not soft. Mm -hmm. I agree with that. It's also, um. The iced um, oatmeal, mm. it's like a little, it's a, you got a cinnamon flavor to it as That's well. That's interesting. That's interesting. I love oatmeal. That's my favorite cookie. Mm. I'm the same way. I love oatmeal cookies without raisins. You take out raisins out of an oatmeal cookie, they are the best, like, they're wow, the best I'm, cookie. I like it with the raisins, guys. Is that weird? Really? Yeah. Do you like chocolate chip and raisins or just? My favorite cookie of all time is oatmeal chocolate chip. Okay. Yeah. That's, I agree with that. That, yeah. that. that is like a, that's a fair, I hate, you combine those two, it's, it's a good cookie. Yeah. Right. Okay, ready? Three, two, one. 8.7. Okay. Cool. You, you want to go ahead? Yeah, you know, I, I loved it. I thought it was, um, I love the texture. I agree with you. I expected it to be a harder. little bit harder. Yeah, it looks hard. Um, 
love the cinnamon. I feel like it's like got like a hint of pumpkin. I don't think it does, but uh, okay. I, I loved it. I um I thought it was just all around good cookie. Love the you, texture. You can taste the oatmeal. Yeah. Like really, really taste the oatmeal. Like it's like I don't know how to explain. Like the oats, guys. Like it's not really too like blended if you know what i mean i don't know if, if that makes sense but i loved it iced oatmeal amazing cookie 8.4 definitely have to get it this week i think oatmeal fans you have to get it that's fair so yeah uh we were pretty yeah the, I, mean, I mean i feel like the energy is here today because we're off so yeah we're, we're going boom boom through the reviews usually it takes us a little minute but i feel like we're just being honest today and it's, it's we're we're always honest we're going through always it. <laughs> always honest always honest but sometimes it takes some time to get get the understanding of the flavors yeah today. with it's classic peanut butter we were just like no we were, we weren't feeling that today. i have the next pick this is easy it's gonna be lemon cheesecake come on guys oh wow i'm surprised why i thought you were gonna pick chocolate really like, yeah no nah, that chocolate is good bro that really is good. i know you like lemon i like lemon crumble i like i feel like crumble really got me into lemon you like lemon tarts no that's what i'm saying i don't like any lemon desserts i but... thought you would like lemon tart for some reason no you know um what are those key lime pie cakes? I used to hate those. Mm. I need to try one. It's been a long time. All right, here's the lemon cheesecake, guys. Ooh. Who doesn't like cheesecake? This is thick. Sean, fun fact, this might, I don't know how this is gonna sit with you. I've never been to Cheesecake Factory, ever. So it's been a couple years for me, but Cheesecake Factory, in my opinion, is so underrated. Okay, that's good. Um, Number one, like they have an amazing healthy menu as well. Okay. A lot of people underrate them for that. Their portions are massive. If you're just like in their their menu is like a book. It's so weird. I want to go. It's like one of those places. It's so weird that they have such a massive menu and things are like so consistently good across. Exactly. It. Like large menus usually means yeah, made or miss. Yeah. Let's go. I'm Let's down. do it. Yeah. Mm. 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 Oh, I'm I'm not reacting until mm -hmm. I'm not gonna. Did Crumble join? Mm. No, 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 Crumble didn't join. <laughs> um, you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Three, two, one, eight point eight. 8. Okay. Oh, you put it over the oatmeal. Yeah, yeah. Wow. I um okay, I'll let you go first. Why why didn't why didn't you like it as much? For me, I was gonna put I was gonna say eight point six, but then in my head I was like, is it really better than the oatmeal? I enjoyed the oatmeal more. It's not saying this is a bad cookie. Lemon cheesecake, that was actually really good mm -hmm. for a lemon cookie. Yeah. It's not really overpowering. The lemon just the lemon cream is just barely on top, guys. Not overpowering at all. It's a great cookie. I highly recommend getting it. 8.2 doesn't mean it's bad. It means it's a solid cookie. That's fair. I uh, I loved it because, number one, it's a beautiful looking cookie. Like, I feel like you just got to give credit on that. I love the buttery graham, like, crust that they have. Yeah. Like, it's just, like, very, like, um... Yeah. Oh, man. The I feel like we're destroying your good. car, Beanie. Um, I, I'm due for a car wash. We're good. But it's like, a, it's a, I don't know. I really like it. And uh, I agree with you. It's Texture's like, it's really like good. a good good amount of lemon. It's not overpowering. Yeah. But I think they did a good job. Uh, that's why I give it 8.8. Solid week so far. But I do think this is going to be a one If like one cookie, I already know what it's going to be. And it's not even a question. Just because you have to try it, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You have to go get the Tres Leches this week. Oh, yeah. Everyone has to go get it, no matter what. By the way, um, I do want to point out what the Tres Leches is. If you go to Crumble, it is a little bit more expensive than a normal cookie. So I think for this, I had to pay a dollar thirty nine extra. So just be aware of that when you go, um, it's not the same price. Does leches mean milk? I I don't. I think Tres is three. Three, yeah, three milk. So is it like three types of milk? Maybe, mm. maybe. I'll look that up after. I just did Spanish too. I didn't do Spanish three or four in high school or beyond. I I, I actually speak a little bit of Spanish. No way. Yeah. Okay. You should do this full thing in Spanish. CC. <laughs> <laughs> CC means yes, guys. Oh wow. Yeah. You learn you learn something new every day. All right, Beanie. Now we got to, we're doing translations next. Oh no 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 no. Oh, right. no. oh right, guys. Oh shoot! I thought you were saving best for last. Whoa. Oh, <laughs> I'm whoa, kidding. Whoa. I'm kidding. Cake uh, brownie batter. Wait, Beanie, it? uh, uh, yeah, it's cake, uh, chocolate, cake batter. Beanie, make sure to make sure you get one with like some cake batter on top. Okay, okay, there it is. I had some of the best, uh, best brownies at your place. Like, oh yeah, party. yeah, one of our buddies made them. Yeah, he's such a good cook. I remember them. Yeah, I might or post an order. To be fair, he just he, he just <laughs> got a big box and just. Made I just love egging it on, like <laughs> to think that you made it, but yeah. he didn't make it. He just <laughs> got a cake batter and just did it that way. All right, guys, cake, <laughs> cake batter cookie. All right, here we go. Mmm. That fudge is thick. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. It's thick, yeah. I'm ready. Okay. Three, two, one, eight. Eight point nine nine. Oh wow. Yeah. Wow, no, you didn't give it a nine. You yeah. just eight point nine nine. I think it's not it's not a nine cookie, but it is phenomenal. 
Mm. That is a good cookie, Sean. The chocolate, the flavors there, I, I love it. Yeah, it's like it's like a fudge cookie. There's so much chocolate, but it, like it, 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 it does really well. It's not overpowering at all. You know, I, I, I the only thing I wish they had more is a little bit of that cake batter more on top. Okay. I like the texture of it. Um, that's a good cookie, guys. Yeah. Nine out of ten. I'm sorry. What am I doing? That's a nine. That's a good cookie. Dang, you give it a nine. That's a good cookie, Sean. What wow. did you give it? I gave it a 8.6. So I actually you got lemon over that? Yeah. Nah, bro. Come on. And I'm a chocolate lover. I am. Um, yeah, Why? I don't know. I you know I weirdly think crumbles like chocolate cookies just don't live up to the hype. Does anyone else agree that lemon is better than chocolate? Come on, guys. We're saying lemon is better than chocolate now. For me, yeah. If, does anyone agree with Sean? These specific cookies, I will say. Comment that. below if you agree with him. Yeah, yeah. Let me know. Go, no one's go try it, Sean. No one's no one's agreeing with that. I don't Dang. think so. Let's see. Let's see. <laughs> yeah. Um. Oh shoot. Okay. So next, we actually have to do tres leches. But let me make sure I have the napkins. Um. The napkins I mean, no, 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 not napkins. Um. Spoons. Oh yeah, we got spoons. So, just a heads up. Um. Yes, spoons. If you're getting a tres leches cookie, you cannot eat this with your hand, unfortunately. Um, I would recommend asking the Crumble employees for spoons. They do have spoons. Why doesn't Crumble just, uh, when you order Tres Leches, just give a... Just oh, so people are commenting, I prefer chocolate. Dang. Thank you. Chocolate. So, dang, somebody, did somebody, a lot of y'all just go eat it already? It's only Monday. I guess a lot of people are off work today. And so. it's also 3 o'clock already, so. Yeah. We usually do our reviews afternoon of Monday, guys, so that's yeah. why they're posted late Monday. It's like after work, yeah. but, um, but yeah, let's do it, Tres Leches, y'all. That's a, ooh, I'm so scared it's gonna fall. How are we gonna do this, Sean? No, we just dig in. Wow, that's that went through easy. Wow. Let's show them. It is spongy, guys. Tres leches from Crumble. That looks beautiful. Not Crumble cookies, from Crumble. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yeah. You, you ready? I think I think we both know our score. Yeah. Three, two, one. Nine point two. Yeah. Nine point two. Yeah. Sean said nine point two. I said nine point three. That's. I, I just, will say one thing though. If you're getting this or door dashing it, I wouldn't wait thirty to forty minutes. Mm -hmm. If you get it, put it in the fridge or something. Eat it fresh, right? That's nice and cold, Sean. This, this is like one of those where let's say you're working out or something, um, or like let's say you're just on the way back home. Just order this and eat it. You'll have a good time. I agree with Beanie. Do not, do not let this like sit. What might be the move is, like, like what if you were to recommend like a combination to four? people, like let's say four. What are you doing? For four for yourself, or are you are you doing with someone? I said for yourself, I would get tres leches, chocolate, lemon, and oatmeal. I think you gotta try them all, but I wouldn't disagree with a two tres leches and a two chocolate. Okay. But I, I know you want to throw lemon in there. For me, I'm doing two tres leches and two chocolates. I'm having one of each and giving one of each to whoever I'm with, my significant other, my friends, whatever. That's fair. I I agree with you. I think, um, man. That's such a good cookie, guys. Tres leches from Crumble? Oh, my goodness. Yeah. I think I'm going to do one tres leches, one lemon, one ice oatmeal, and one chocolate. That's what I would do. Okay. But we both can agree that if you're getting one cookie, it's tres leches. Not even a cookie. It's a cake. But, like, you have to get it this week. Yeah. You have to. It's, uh, it, it'd be a major miss not yeah. to get it. And Sean, can I say, like, all these cookies, like, making these every day for the, every, all, like, all week, it's a lot of work. I know. Like, I, I was talking to somebody who, um, who owns a bakery and, and apparently, like, changing up the menu every single week is, like, it's pretty that's hard. It's pretty difficult. And to do it right. That's yeah. the thing. Like, to make it, to make things taste Crumble's good. always consistent. They're always consistent, usually. Except the New York location. Yeah. That's fair. <laughs> But y'all, if you if you um, if if y'all if y'all get this, wh whoever put the classic peanut butter crumble employee, man, come on, man. <laughs> you don't want to say something. You don't want to say. No, no. You don't want to say what you're truly feeling. Uh, I, but like, what? Like, wh it's so like good. It, it's such an amazing lineup. And then you just add this, like, it's that one meme. Is that what you're talking about? The army, and then there's a clown in the middle. Yeah, it's like I don't know the exact meme, but it's just like one is not like the other. Like, look how beautiful all this looks. And then you just have classic peanut butter on top. Like, yeah. what's going on here? Who is asking for classic peanut butter? Um, <laughs> I, I guess you guys uh, needed to sell the five, six cookies. So. If, if you're, if, if someone this week goes to Chrome and gets just classic peanut butter, we didn't have a talk. Uh, you good? <laughs> yeah. Oh, honestly, like, uh, good, if, if, I, if I'm like waiting outside Crumble, waiting for my cookies and I just see that happen, 
like I, I'm judging that person. What are you doing if someone is in front of you is picking up a four pack of just ch peanut butter? Are you saying something to them? Be like, bro, like, like, why? Like, no, no, I'm not. I, honestly, I may out of just to disrespect them, I would say something. Like, come on, you're getting four peanut butter. Now, somebody got four tres leches. Yeah, I'd be like. If they're eating, if it's just for themselves, Mike, you know, like, I'd respect that. Yeah. I'd respect that. And I, <laughs> Ooh. An idea. What is that? Yeah. Oh, no, no, nothing. Somebody invited us <laughs> to go live. Go ahead. Go ahead. No, 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 no. all good. We need to, <laughs> we're finishing up. No, I was going to say, Sean, is the, is the Tres Leches just by itself or can you order like a tray? You know, that's a, that's a good question. I believe, like, I think you could call Crumble and you can get it. You could potentially order a yeah. tray. Yeah. But I think I think they're for now. They're selling it individually. By the way, I, I just want to say I love Crumble's um, transition from just being a cookie company to a cake company because I think the two cakes that we've had or the three cakes that we've had yeah. have been all amazing. Do you do you see Crumble in the future going to like a selling like cold whole like like big cakes like birthday cakes like orders for those maybe? I I could see that. I could see like a like crumble birthday cakes. Um, by the way, I don't know if you know on the crumble app. There's like this. Uh, I think they partnered up with Olivia Rodrigo, so now they're like doing a, a cookie tour. So okay. like so like different parts of the country. Um, she's like a famous singer. Okay. Um, but basically, like they're doing a cookie tour where she has her own cookie, and so we don't. We're getting ours. I think either next week or the week after. Olivia's. Yeah. Okay. So like they have this like it's called like the it's a glam cookie. But I think it's like with sprinkles. Remember, remember that like uh, oh, yeah, Valentine yeah. cookie with the heart, jam heart? Yeah. I think it's like that with the sprinkles. So I think Crumble's doing a lot of cool stuff. Wait, that's pretty cool because that's kind of like how McDonald's did like the Travis Scott meal. Yeah. Like partnering up with big time people and have, uh, that's pretty cool. I like that. Yeah. Maybe an athlete in the future, Crumble? That'd be pretty cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or a Taylor Swift cookie or something like that. Yeah. We didn't have to say that, Sean. Yeah. Yeah, but yeah, that would be so, <laughs> A Taylor Swift cookie, that would be so cool. I, I would get it that day. Yeah. For sure. I'm going out of my way to get that. Yeah. <laughs> it's all the week though, guys. Um, anything else, Sean? Uh, you want to give your life advice? Life advice. Uh, man, I don't really have life advice today. I would say know what you want in life. Uh, but we got we had work off today, so we didn't, <laughs> we didn't need to think about life advice. I just want to say, yeah, I'm trying to think of something on the spot. Um, maybe maybe it's all right. We can skip we can skip it this. Week. I would say there's no age age for success, like. The people around you are like the people around me are getting married and stuff like that. I feel like there's no age. Mm -hmm. That doesn't mean that oh you start forcing a marriage, right? Just live your life. Everything will happen. Everything will fall in place. He went to an engagement this weekend, and now he's like having thoughts about like oh man. No, I'm, uh. I'm just saying the people around us are getting married, right? Is that right? Is that is that cool advice? No peer pressure. Yeah, I, I don't disagree. But at certain points, you know, you, you got to move on with life. But it, it, it's it's up to you. I'm is kidding. I'm kidding. I'm is there an age? Age for what? To get married. Uh, no, I don't think so. I think you can get married whenever you want. What's, uh, what's your ideal age, if you don't mind me asking? Uh, I would say, like, 30. 30. Yeah, 30. That'd be, that'd be the ideal age. What do you guys think? By the way, we're getting... off topic, but... Yeah, what yeah. Is it? We're getting a lot of comments. Uh, um, let's read some questions out for the, for... For the folks. For YouTube. Yeah, let's see. Oh, jeez. You can just hold it now. Okay, let's see. Um, I'm planning on taking my girl out for her five-year anniversary. What's the nicest restaurant in H-Town? There you go, Sean. In Houston. Uh, go to this place called Katami. Um, it's one of my favorite sushi spots of all time. What uh, if, what, what if uh, besides sushi? Besides sushi, uh, there's a place called Nobis. Um, yes. Legit, like, if you take her to Nobis, you'll have one of the best uh, meals of your life. Ask for uh, a waiter named Mike. And... Oh. Uh, Abs, great guy. He'll treat you guys really well, um, and make sure to get a blueberry pie. But I don't know if the Crumble crowd is interested in um, specifically Houston's or the. the we'll Houston let it go. Crowd. We'll let it go. We're just answering some questions on TikTok, guys. Good afternoon from Baltimore. Hey, I like lemon better. I'm not a chocolate lover. Let's go. I respect that. Did someone say I prefer lemon than chocolate? We're actually getting a lot of support for lemon. Wow. We're we're uh, we're getting a lot of support for lemon. Thank y'all. I, I appreciate that. I guess I was wrong, guys. People like lemon over chocolate. That's, not, that's what the world's come to, guys. Oh, uh, no, no, no. Uh, not Takami. Katami. Katami. Yeah, and Nobis. Uh, N-O-B-I-E-S. Ask for a waiter named Mike. Um, and Nobis will be... It'll be one of the best meals of your life. Again, try to make a reservation of both of these spots if uh, if you can. Yeah, shout out Lemon. We're getting a lot of Lemon support here. Um, yeah, 
Okay, cool. Well, is there anything else that you want to tell the the YouTube folks? Um, I mean, not no. Uh, just see you guys next week. We'll do a we're doing a giveaway in a couple weeks probably. So stay tuned. Like, subscribe. Cool. Matt, I mean, do you want to say anything, Sean? Any life advice? No, no, no. guys. Uh, make sure to uh, like and subscribe and. Um, yeah, no life advice uh, this week. Beanie Beanie covered it. That was a good yeah, uh, we, You know, just take your time, guys. Enjoy Chromo. Go get the Tres Leches and have a good week. I hope everyone has a fantastic week. Yeah. It, it, here's the thing. When work starts uh, tomorrow, it's uh, four more days until the weekend. Yeah, and stay positive, right? If, you, yeah. if you're going to work with a negative attitude, the day is going to be negative. Yeah. So why not just go into it positive so you have a positive day? If you wake up angry and wake up negative, your day is going to be negative. So Got wake it. up and be positive, guys. There's no point of living life so negative, you know? Agreed. Gotta be yeah. positive.